For the first stage, tighten the screws of the injector with a torque of 15 newton meters. Then in a second stage, with a 90 degree angle, twice. Once the screws are tightened, use a straight edge to check that all injectors are exactly the same height. If that's the case, tighten all the nuts of the high pressure lines, first with 7 Newton meters of torque. Then repeat the process on each one with 33 newton meters of torque. Install the adapter wiring harness back into place and reconnect the plug. Now make the injector code on the engine unrecognizable. Continue with star diagnosis and use the scanner. For the following steps, star diagnosis must be online. Select the control unit engine electronics. Read and confirm the safety tips. Then select the special procedures tab. Click on Exchange Injectors and press Next twice. In our case, no error has been saved. Indicate why you've changed the injectors. Then enter the manufacture date of the old injectors. Read the instructions. Now click on injector 1 and scan the left side of the old injector code. Cover up the right code. The production date is now determined. Repeat the steps for the other injectors. In the next step you'll be automatically shown how to return the old injectors. Now to the injected fuel quantity adjustment. Again, read the safety tips. The next step is to choose the fuel quantity adjustment for the injector of the first cylinder. Scan the right code on the new injectors. Cover the left code. Scan the code and press the start button to transfer the new values into the control unit. Important! Repeat the injection quantity adjustment in the other new injectors. Only then are you finished with the adjustment. The error memory will be erased.
When you return to the vehicle selection page, the operation is completed and the new injectors are ready.